When we had our first meeting in August, he was, you know, he had this amazing mood board and lots of pictures telling me what his inspiration was for the show. And it was sort of like, you know, inspired by Charles Darwin and sort of uh, the evolution of man and, and also looking forward to the, looking at the future and how, you know, morphing, people morphing into sort of something else. And, um, so that was the kind of brief when we were talking and what he was sort of thinking about.
incredible show, out of this world, an underworld, in fact, a water world, and completely brilliantly conceived. Incredible prints, amazing construction of clothes. Those shoes were made of fiberglass. Some of the beading was all like little tiny metal plates. Did you notice the models' faces were built up with sort of strange lumps? So they, like that scene in Star Trek, you know, with all those strange animals were playing the, you know, instruments and things. I was speaking with Guido backstage, and yeah. he was saying that that so many people are altering themselves now that yeah. maybe that's what we just naturally look like a hundred years from now. I know. Who knows? I mean, heaven knows what's going to happen when all the Botox collapses. <laughs> The whole thing worked. As a, you know, I thought it was incredibly well thought out. I mean, there was just like, you know, as it is with him, it's architecture and mathematics, and he just gets everything right because he understands human anatomy and the human form, and 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 he stretches it. He just stretches it to the limit.